save the king. Groomed for decades, this was the moment King Charles waited for his entire life. His first speech as monarch. Queen Elizabeth was a life well lived. And he made it clear, promise, like his yes. mother, he promised to never give up the post until death. That promise of lifelong service I renew to you all today. Charles ascends to the throne at 73, the longest wait in British history. The decades have given him many strengths, experience, patience, preparation, but weaknesses too. Charles has struggled with personal popularity in his role as the Prince of Wales. I think he made a big step forward today. I think people now will look to him after that speech which, with much more sympathy than they felt before. Charles grew up at his mother's side, but her popularity never quite rubbed off. But signs today that her passing may have opened hearts to him. I think the reception he's had at Buckingham Palace today gives me great hope that the monarchy will continue for many years. King Charles became the Prince of Wales at 20. He was a pilot in the Air Force and commanded a ship in the Royal Navy. With this ring, I thee wed. I thee wed. He was 32 when he married Lady Diana Spencer. And I suppose in love. Of course. <laughs> Whatever in love means. <laughs> Charles was soon in the shadow of a star. It was a dark time for him and the royal family of divorce and Diana's death. Charles turned to campaigning for the environment and remarried, this time to his old love, Camilla. He took on more royal duties as his mother's health faded, and he's learned the power of charisma, already turning to his popular son, William, and his wife. He's going to use William, who is very popular, to take up the causes that he will no longer be able to go so public about, I think will also be very much in his favor. The next generation of British kings is in line. No queens on the horizon. Charles, William, and George seen together during the late Queen's Jubilee. A new chapter begins for a king with vast preparation and a history. Richard, fair to say there's going to be a lot of focus on Kate now with her new title, the Princess of Wales. And that focus seems in some ways deliberate. She is already a very popular young royal here. And now, effective immediately, she has the same title that Diana once had. Uh, through sources, Princess Kate said that she is aware of the history but wants to focus on the future and chart her own path. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.